Hi, m a y b e v e r s So today I wanted to do a little quick talk on manifestation. Um, you have probably heard of it, but what exactly is manifesting, right? And essentially, manifesting is turning your dreams, your goals, something that you want uh, into reality through attraction, beliefs, and actions. Because um, many people think that all we need to do is to just wish and to hope for the things we want, and then it's going to come true. Um, I wish it's that way, but it really takes a combination of having a positive mindset and aligning our actions with our dreams. So, how do we start to manifest? Three things. Number one, get clear with your goals, because the universe wants to co-create with you, wants to deliver the things that you're asking for. But if you're just wishy-washy and being unsure, it wouldn't know what to do. So, get clear. And then number two, once you're clear, send it out that message. Send it out to the universe, and you can do that by saying a prayer. You can do a meditation. You can write them all down in a journal or just a piece of paper. And then uh, one other thing I really like doing is to create a vision board. Get creative. You know, basically, um, the more you see it, the more you read it. Uh, it's just it's just a beautiful reminder. And then number three is to create a supportive environment. What I mean by having a supportive environment is to have things around you and with you to help you stay centered and to help you stay focused on your goals. Because life is a beautiful chaos, and uh, we need all the help we can get to to help us to bring some peace back while we are manifesting. So, one of the tools that I really like is. The intuition ritual kit. It has the amethyst, the sage, the candles, and a palo. Um, it's such a gorgeous combination because amethyst is all about connection with oneness. I mean, at the end of the day, uh, we need to trust that what we want, the dreams that we are, we are, we are putting out there, it will come true.